Hello, I'm Chuck Herman from Rocky Shores Local News. Tonight, we have a special report on life in the Rocky Shores community, where we'll give you a special insider's look on what it's like to live in this exciting area. The Rocky Shores area is full of rock cliffs, enormous boulders, and small cobbles, or an assortment of structures built by humans, like wood pilings, concrete seawalls, and rock jetties. The rock shores are broken up into three different zones. The low, the high, and the middle intertidal zones. First, we will begin with the low intertidal zone. Here, we have some sea stars who have agreed to answer some questions for us. So, Mr. Sea Star, how are you this evening? Oh, you know, you can't complain. Good. So why do you live in the low intertidal zone? Well, this area is only exposed in extremely low tides, so we're pretty much submerged all day. Me and many other creatures down here don't like the heat and dry that other zones have. What are some of the other creatures that live here? Well, there are anemones, sea cucumbers, sponges, shrimps, lots and lots of seaweed. Yep, seaweed. I don't like many of the other, other neighbors, though. Oh no, here comes some of those, some of them now. The carnival, go with us, the carnival. <laughs> We're going with us, the carnival, go with us, the carnival. Hey, weird, weirdo, Jeffy, I told you to stop doing that near my house. Well, charming bunch of neighbors you got there. <laughs> Thanks for your time, Mr. Steve Star. Okay. Next, we will move on to the middle intertidal zone of the Rocky Shores. This zone is underwater 50% of the time. The creatures who make their home here must be able to survive the owning of the waves against the shore and harsh exposure to the sun. <laughs> oh look! A cluster of mussels! Let's see what they're up to. Hello sir, I'm Chuck Herman from the Rocky Shores Local News. May I ask you a few questions? No. Go away. Oh, just ignore him. Ask away, darling. You muscles of the middle intertidal zone must endure the crashing waves along the rocks. How are you able to do that? With my beard. Now go away. What my friend here means is... I ain't your friend. We muscles have what is called a bisol thread that is a silky filament by which certain mollusks attach themselves to hard surfaces. Could you show me this bisol thread? Oh, of course, darling. But be sure to get my good side. Oh, wait. All of me is a good side. Mi amor. Mi encanta su barba. Es muy caliente. Oh, darling. Your English subtitles are making me blush! I hate all of you. We should probably cut this short. We muscles must close to conserve our H2O molecules. Why don't you just live in the lower zone where there's more water? Here, I'll show you. Oh no! The echinoderms will consume my visceral mass! Wow! Uh, maybe we could edit that out. No, I, li I liked it. I, I liked it. Now then, we should probably head up to the high intertidal zone. 
Good bar muscles. Good 